In your annual shareholder letter this year, you said that Berkshire's journey consisted of continuous savings, the power of compounding, the American tailwind, and avoidance of major mistakes. You have humbly admitted in the past that you have made many mistakes, but this is the first time that major mistakes stood out to me. Could you please advise us on what major mistakes we should learn, we should avoid in both investing and in life? I would also like to have Mr. Munger's thoughts too, please. Thank you very much. Well, let me... Charlie, Charlie said the major mistake you can make, then, you know, you're, you're lucky if you're in the United States. If you go around the world, you don't have a lot of choices some, in some places. But, but you, should, you should write your obituary and then try and figure out how to live up to it. Uh, and, uh, uh, you know, that's, that's something you get wiser on as you uh, go along. The business mistakes... Uh, you just want to make sure you don't make any mistakes to take you out of the game or come close to taking you out of your game. You should never have a night when you're worried about uh, investing. I mean, assuming you have any money to invest at all, and you should, you should, you should spend a little bit less than you earn, and you can spend a little bit more than you earn, and then, then you've got debt, and the chances are you'll never get out of debt. Uh, I'll make an exception in terms of, of a mortgage on your house, but, but credit card debt, we're in the credit card business big time, and we'll stay in the credit card business, but why get behind the game? And if you're effectively paying 12 or 14 or whatever percent you're paying on a credit card, you know, you're saying, I'm going to earn more than 12 or 14 percent of money, and if you can do that, come to Berkshire Hathaway. So it, it, uh, it, it, it's, it's, I hate to say this when Charlie's around me, but it's straight out of Ben Franklin. I mean, <laughs> and, uh, 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 it's not, it's not, it's not that complicated, but, uh, you, well, I'll, I'll give you a couple lessons. I'll, you know, Tom Murphy, t the first time I met him, said two things to me. He said, you can always tell someone to go to hell tomorrow. Well, that was great advice then. And think of what great advice it is when you, when you sit down at a computer and screw your life up forever by, by telling somebody to go to hell or something else in 30 seconds and you can't erase it. Uh, and, you know, you haven't lost the option. Uh, you know, and, 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 and he said, you know, praise, praise by name, criticize by category. Well, what, what makes more sense than that? I mean, who do you like that criticizes you all the time? And uh, uh, you, don't need to, you don't need to vilify anybody to make your point. On, 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 on subjects of discussion, and and uh, and then the, I'll give you another general piece of advice. I've I've never known anybody that was basically kind that died without friends, and uh, I've known plenty of people with money that have died without friends, uh, including their family, and uh, but I've never known anybody. And and, and uh, you know, I've seen a few people, including Tom Murphy Sr. And maybe Junior, who's here, <laughs> but certainly his dad. Uh, he, I never saw him. I, I watched him for 50 years. I never saw him do an unkind act. I didn't. I didn't seem to do very many stupid acts either. I mean, it wasn't that he was non-discriminating. He just, he just, uh, he just decided that uh, that there was no reason to do it. And uh, wow, what a difference that makes in life, Charlie. Well, it's it's so simple to spend less than you earn and invest shrewdly and avoid toxic people and toxic activities and try and keep learning all your life, et cetera, et cetera, and do a lot of deferred gratification because you prefer life that way. And if you do all those things, you are almost certain to succeed. And if you don't, you're going to need a lot of luck a lot of luck and you don't want to need a lot of luck you want to go into a game where you're very likely to win without having any unusual luck I'd add one more thought too I, you need to know how people can manipulate other people and then you need to resist the temptation to do it yourself oh yes the, 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 the toxic people 
who are trying to fool you or lie to you who aren't reliable in meeting their commitments. The great lesson of life is get them the hell out of your life. Yep. And do it fast. Do it fast.